Hey you guys, it's Stone. Welcome to my YouTube channel, Body Set in Stone. I'm Stone Clark, your fitness, nutrition, and self-love enthusiast. Guys, before we continue the video, can you do me a favor and click subscribe below? Please help a brother out, share the video, just support me, okay? Thank you. So guys, it's been a while and a lot has changed. As you can see in the back of me, there's a beautiful blanket of a collage of my best friend and I, um, specialist Raymond Wise. Um, Ray and I uh, were going to be best friends for 10 years um, come February 8th, and he lost his life on September 22nd while in El Paso, Texas, doing a field op. And um, he was a fueler for the United States Army, and he was a specialist. And this is Ray, and um, I just wanted to talk to you guys a little bit and stuff like that. So um, the day that I found out that he died actually was one of the worst days of my adult life. Um, you know, the calls came in like a set of three, you know? It was like I got a call from my one buddy about something that had nothing to do with Ray, and then I got a call from Ray's fiance, and then I got a call from one of Ray's other best friends. And you know, I just knew in my heart that something was terribly wrong, and as soon as she said my name, I just knew it was the worst news. I knew I was going to have to be prepared for the worst news of my life. And um, it sucked. You know, um, we were best friends like no other. You know, our friendship was one of those friendships that you've seen like on the movies or on the Disney Channel and stuff like that. We we had so many dreams that we wanted to conquer together, which we did. And um, I just felt like a piece of my heart was ripped out of my chest, you know. Um, so it, it, was, it was crazy. And I really just want to say to anyone out there, first of all, let me just say to anybody out there in the military, thank you so much for your sacrifice. For real, like people really don't know what you guys go through and how much of your life you sacrifice and, and like in terms of being with your loved ones, just doing the normal things. Thank you so much for your sacrifice. I, I mean it from the bottom of my heart. Um, you know, Ray had just hit his two year mark um, of being in the United States Army. And he had a lot of things going on. He was getting ready to go to air assault school. He was getting ready to be married, literally two to three weeks after he died. He, you know, his wedding date was three weeks from then. And um, all I just wanted to say to you guys is that the best way for you to honor someone that is no longer here is to live for them. And I mean, m more importantly, live for yourself, but use their energy to fuel you to really get through life. You know, um, life after death is a bitch, you know, um, not being able to hear from him every day, no more texts, no more calls, no more funny jokes on Facebook. It's just tomorrow's going to be 30 days and it's been almost the worst 30 days of my life. You know, it's like some days I'm good, some days I'm bad. And, um, I, I, I truly do miss him and I hope that I can find some strength through this pain and I could really stay on top of this YouTube channel and just give you guys uh, words of wisdom, words of love, and um, yeah. So this is Raymond. Um, I really uh, don't want to spend this video going into details about his life because I want to give him more time. So the next video to come will be talking about him more in depth. but. He was my best friend. He was one of the loves of my life. Um, he was one in a million. And, you know, guys, just really, guys and girls, excuse me, really cherish people while they're here on this earth still. Definitely do that. You know, don't let any argument, any little mishap or miscommunication, you know, cause a rift or create a level of distance to the point where you're going to be like, bamboozled if something just happens to them and your last words were like F you or mean words or whatever the case may be. So definitely hold on to your loved ones and cherish them while they're here. Um, I have this saying 
that I would like to share with you guys, and I will let you guys go. Never allow the mistakes from your past to keep you stuck in your present to the point where you miss out on your future. And um, I have these five words that start with the letter L, and I call them the iconic five. The first word, the first word is love. The second word is living. The third word is liberation. The fourth word is laughter. And the fifth word is loyalty, the iconic five. And, um, you know, just look up the definition of those words and just find the power behind each word. And, um, but guys, thank you for tuning in. Do not forget to click and subscribe. I am Stone Clark. You can follow me on Facebook at Stonewise Clark. You can follow me on um, Instagram, Stone Clark. You can find me on Snapchat at Stone Clark. Um, and that's it. Thank you guys for tuning in. Live simply, laugh often, and love as much as you can. Once again, thank you to everyone out there that has protected and served our country. Thank you so much for your sacrifice. Ray, I love you always and forever. And see you guys later. Bye.